let us do some questions on uh, change in profit sharing ratio. We will do uh, a question on the calculation of the new profit sharing ratio. I will read out the question. It is S, G and K are partners in a firm sharing profits in the ratio of 3 is to 2 is to 3. They admit J as a partner. S surrenders one third of his share. G surrenders one fourth of his share and K surrenders one fifth of his share in favor of G. We have to calculate the new profit sharing ratio. Now, first of all, the old ratio of the partners is 3 by 5 is to 2 by 5 is to, oh sorry, 3 by 8 is to 2 by 8 is to 3 by 8, right. This is the old ratio. Now, we have been given that S surrenders one third of his share, right. So, that will be 1 by 3 into 3 by 8, that will come to 3 upon 24, right. Same way, G surrenders one fourth of his share. So, that comes to 1 by 4 into 2 upon 8. So, that will be 2 upon 32. Then we have the other partner K surrenders one fifth of his share, right. So, that will be 1 upon 5 into 3 upon 8. So, that comes to 3 upon 40 like this. So, this is uh, basically uh, this 3 by 24, 2 by 32 and all. They are surrendering this. So, this is uh, their sacrificing ratio actually. They are sacrificing this from their shares, right. Now, we have found out how much each partner is sacrificing in favor of the new partner. So, now what is the new ratio? The new ratio will be equal to the old ratio minus sacrificing ratio, right. This fine, ok. Now, let us calculate the new ratio. So, here let us calculate the new ratio for each partner. For S, it will be old ratio of S is 3 by 8 minus minus the sacrificing ratio that we calculated that was 3 upon 24. Right. So, this comes to 24 here denominator and this will be 9 minus 3 which will be equal to 6 upon 24. Right. Same way for G, the old ratio was 2 upon 8. minus the sacrificing ratio came to 2 upon 32, right. So, this will be equal to again here, this will be 32 here. So, 4 to the 8, it will be 8 minus 2 that will be equal to 6 upon 32, right. For k, the old ratio was 3 by 8 
minus the sacrificing ratio came to 3 upon 40 right. So, here the new ratio will be this 40 is the denominator. So, I have 12 upon 40 fine. Now, I have found out the new ratio for the existing partners. Now, the new ratio uh, I will put it like this j s share will be equal to the sacrificing ratio of s plus g plus k right. So, here this will be 3 by 24 that was the sacrificing ratio of s plus 2 by 32 of g and k surrendered 3 by 40 right. Now, if you do this 24, 32 and 40 the LCM of 24, 32 and 40 will come to 480 <coughs> right. So, here this will be the denominator 24 480 divided by 24 is 20. So, 23 is a 60 it will be 60 plus here it will be 15 15 to the 30 and then lastly it will be 36 ok. So, this comes to 60 plus 30 90, 90 plus 36 is 126 upon 480. So, when you simplify this 126 upon 480, it comes to 21 upon 80, 21 upon 80 right. Now, we have calculated the new ratio for S, G, K and J. Now, let us put it down here. So, the new ratio here it is S is to G is to K is to J right. So, it will be 6 upon 24 is to six upon thirty two is to twelve upon forty. These are the new ratios that we calculated twelve upon forty here. 6 upon 24 for S, 6 upon 32 for G, 12 upon 40 for K and 21 upon 80 for J right. So, the next one is going to be 21 upon 80 like this. So, again we will have to take a common uh, denominator the common denominator will again work out to 480 you have to take the LCM of all the four numbers. Right, so, the LCM of all the 4 numbers will be 480. So, now you will have this 24 goes 20 times in 480. So, 26 are 120 it will be 32 goes 15 times. So, 15 6 are sorry um, yeah 90 and then 40 this is 12 times. So, 12 twelves are 144 and then finally, you have 80. So, that will be 6. So, that comes to 126 right. Now, so this means it is 120 is to 90 is to 
144 is to 126. All of them are divisible in the table of 6, right. So, this becomes 20 is to 15 is to 24 is to 21. So, the answer will be 20 is to 15 is to 24 is to 21. Okay. So, first of all we calculated the share that each partner surrendered that is the sacrificing ratio because in this question the new ratio the, the new partners ratio is not given right only the sacrificing uh, ratios are given right. So, you found out the sacrificing ratios from the shares that they are sacrificing then the new ratio for all the partners. So, new ratio as I have put down here this is equal to the old ratio minus the sacrificing ratio right. So, this you have to remember here this formula fine ok. Now, finally, you put down the new ratios of all the partners together and this is your answer ok. So, with that I come to the end of this uh, solution for this question on calculation of new profit sharing ratio. Thank you.